Hello YouTube, welcome back to Darth Nico Games. So for those of you who don't know, I uh, work at Chick-fil-A. That's something that I haven't shared on this channel. Some of you uh, who like talk with me on Discord already know that. But yes, I work at Chick-fil-A. Um, here's the proof here. Uh, I have since like July. I'm gonna try to like not poke myself here. Perfect. So yeah, anyway, since I work at Chick-fil-A, I figured it would make sense for me, you know, make a Chick-fil-A video, given that it eats up, like, a ton of my time. But, uh, so, yes, I am ranking the, uh, eight entrees on the Chick-fil-A menu, uh, so we're not counting, like, de the deluxe versions of the Chick-fil-A sandwich, it's just, like, you know, numbers one through eight. So, you know, you've got your number one, which is the Chick-fil-A sandwich, number two, the spicy sandwich, number three, the nuggets. Number four, the strips. Number five, the grilled sandwich. Number seven, grilled nuggets. No, sorry, that's number number six is grilled nuggets. Ignore what I said. <laughs> number six, grilled nuggets. Number seven, grilled club. And number eight, grilled cool wrap. So we are going to, some people would do like a tier list, but tier lists are honestly for wimps. We're doing power rankings. Tier lists are for wimps who can't decide which one is like better if they're all like pretty close they'll just like put them in the same tier and call it a day no we have to we have to figure out they have to go head to head and we have to figure out which one's better so yeah we're gonna do that but um before we start the list i do want to say that uh, all these menu items i they're they're good like i enjoy them just some more than others so all of them are good all of them you should give a shot and try and uh pay Chick-fil-A more money, so maybe they could give me a raise, um, yeah. Also, one more thing before I start the video, I referred to people who were talking to me on Discord. Well, they were talking to me through my Discord server that I've had for, like, a, a long time, and I've never actually announced it on YouTube, so I'm doing that now. So, link in description, please join, because I need people to join that. So, number eight, grilled nuggets. So, yeah, we're starting off a little a little weird. A lot of people, when I tell them that we have grilled nuggets, they're like, what the, What are, what are you talking about? You don't grill nuggets, you fry them. That's just, that's just a thing that you do. But uh, yes, we have grilled nuggets, and uh, they're, they're, they're all right. I mean, there's, yeah, they're okay. I just don't really like the grilled products. Uh, at least that's, you know, compared to the fried products, I don't like that as much. The reason that I'm putting them last is that I actually, like, prefer the sandwiches over, like, the nuggets and strips and all the things that you can dip. Like, as a general rule, I'm, I'm more of a sandwich guy. So, yeah, grilled nuggets, they're on the bottom of my list. But, uh, as I go through the, uh, video, I'm gonna tell you what, uh, sauces are, like, good with some of these items. So, the grilled nuggets are really good specifically with, like, Polynesian sauce and the uh, sweet and spicy sriracha. The, those, uh, that pairs pretty well. So yeah, if you're, if you're getting the grilled nuggets, uh, try, try those sauces with them. So for number seven, we have the grilled sandwich. The grilled sandwich is pretty simple. Bun, bun, lettuce, tomato, grilled filet. Yeah, it's pretty straightforward. Now, uh, the reason that it's at seven is that, uh, well, one, everything else is better than it, in my opinion. That's usually how these power rankings work. I would say that the bun on this is, like, really good. Like, it's got, like, a nice wheat bun that's got uh, really good toppings on it. But, again, it's just the grilled filet, and it doesn't come with cheese on it, The uh, just the regular grilled sandwich. So, I mean, that's that's pretty lame. Moving on, I don't have a whole lot to say for this one. The grilled club. So this one is like, the, it's the grilled sandwich, but then on top of the grilled filet and the bun, you put cheese and bacon. Now, obviously, bacon makes everything better. That is a proven fact. Look it up in any dictionary. You look of bacon, there'll be like, you know, it'll say like, you know, meat from pork, and then like under the it'll say it'll just say makes everything better. That's it's common. It's common in many dictionaries. But yeah, so again, just like the added cheese and bacon obviously makes it better than the original grilled sandwich. I mean, that's that's like a no-brainer. But uh, again, because it's a grilled product, I don't really think that it's better than any of the fried products. So yeah, that's why it's there. 
Uh, one thing that I uh, tried pretty recently that's pretty tasty is uh, getting like a, ran a packet of ranch sauce and then putting it on the uh, bun. That's a really good flavor combo. So test that out anytime you're uh, hitting up the good old number seven. All right, the strips. So you get them in little uh, three counts or you get them in four counts. Uh, pretty tasty. I like them. They're like uh, a good size for like the dipping containers. I'm usually, uh, when it's like savory versus sweet, I'm usually a big like savory guy. Like I'm not, I'm not into sweet treats a whole lot. Uh, the strips uh, have this like sweet component that makes them not like go not so well with the uh, standard like, you know, ranch sauces and all that. But it does make them go really well with like the Polynesian sweet and spicy sriracha, uh, barbecue and like honey mustard like it pairs really well with that uh, but I mean all we have left is like the nuggets uh, the two sandwiches uh, and the wrap so I, I think that it's like lower than all those but yeah again tasty tasty I have no hate for any of these items okay I'm just I'm just making a list for no reason because I need to I have no video ideas it's weird because sometimes I'll have like a ton of video ideas, but now I have none. So that's not great. All right, the grilled wrap. So the grilled wrap is probably the most overlooked item on the menu. So like usually when people order, they'll be like looking at the fried stuff or if they want to like go healthy, they'll like go like the grilled sandwiches or if they want to go like really healthy, they'll like go the salads and completely skip the wrap. Like they, they just kind of leave the wrap in the dust, but the, the wrap is like really good. So it's, it's like, it's got like grilled chicken and then cheese and like a bunch of lettuce. I think those are the ingredients. There's probably more of that. I'm not sure, but then it's got like a really good tortilla on the outside. It pairs super well with the avocado lime ranch dressing. Yeah, it's really, uh, really, really good uh, together. Uh, so yeah, try it. Try the wrap. You'll be uh, pleasantly surprised. It's really, really good. So yeah, cool. Uh, moving on to the next one. All right, so the spicy sandwich is really tasty it uh, actually has like the perfect amount of spice because some people you know like they like really spicy things and they're like oh yeah bring it on and then anything that's not like super spicy they'll just they'll like oh, let me just say this it's like a, it's like a good it's perfectly in the middle like it's it's got enough spice for you to like really feel it but it's not enough it's like not too much that you're gonna like burn your tongue off. Uh, so one thing that I uh, like is actually putting like an extra slice of cheese on it to like kind of counteract the spice and add more flavor to it. So that's 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 a good that's a good way to go. One thing that sets the like the fried sandwiches apart from the grilled sandwiches is the buns. While the like while the buns of the grilled sandwiches are good, like a nice wheat. Uh, full bun like you get a full bite with it the uh ones on the fried sandwiches are buttered and that like that like makes a huge difference like sometimes i'll just like order a sandwich and then just pull off the buns and just eat them on their own i'm i'm weird but i i will do that the spice sandwich is number three and now we're moving on to the number two best item the nuggets so this is a huge fan favorite and for good reason the nuggets are Really good uh, for dipping in anything. So you can get them in like eight count and twelve count, and yeah, they're just they're just really good. They uh, they unlike the strips have like less sweet components. They're more savory based, so uh, they pair really well with uh, ranch or Chick Fil A sauce. Uh, that's that's a really uh, reliable combo. Or if you're feeling adventurous, a little buffalo. Buffalo never hurt anybody. I don't really have a whole lot to say about the nuggets. They're just like little little bite-sized, uh, little crunchy bits of goodness. They should be in dinosaur shape, so that'd be cool. Number one is number one. That makes sense, right? So yeah, again, with the fan favorites on this, the number one is just like the perfect sandwich, okay? You can't beat it. Don't, don't try, okay? Any other, if you say that any other sandwich is better than the number one, I will fight you, like, probably i don't know how how tough are you maybe i don't know but yeah the number one is really good again it's got like the buttered buns i just talked about but 
Uh, the reason I like it better than the spicy sandwich is while the spicy sandwich, you know, it's got good kick, there's like less just overall flavor. Like some of it has been replaced by the spice, but the uh, number one uh, like filet is just really, uh, really good, really flavorful. Uh, I love the little crunchy bits on the end that you get. Those are those are top notch. But yeah, you can get it like the original or del the deluxe with like a bunch of toppings on it. Uh, you could do like double cheese on that. You could put uh, sauces. You could put dressings. It's very versatile. But also just the number one, two buns, the filet and pickles. I mean, that's that's good too. Like the number one has so many options. There's so many ways to do it right because it in and of itself is right. And it makes everything around it right, especially when it's in your belly. It makes you right. That, that's how Chick-fil-A workers are able to be like so friendly, guys, because they've eaten the number one sandwich, and it like fills them with warmth. It's it's a thing. Not really, but I, that'd be kind of cool. It'd be just kind of like a power-up, you know, you just like, you'd eat it, and then you'd have like plus five stamina for the rest of the day. Like, that would be, I mean, that would, uh, not, uh, I, yes, that'd be good. So yeah, anyway, that was my list. I'm like really tired. I've gotten like... And, uh, not much sleep the past two days, so I'm kind of like exhausted. I've just been kind of rambling on this whole video, so hopefully that's been funny to you guys. I don't know, and maybe it's been like super cringy. Uh, please join the Discord server, or else I will uh, throw a number one sandwich at your face. And also let me know if you want me to like rank other things, uh, or like you know like other Chick Fil A items, especially. Uh, yeah, just 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 uh, keep me in the loop of what content you want me to be creating because uh, ideas are kind of running thin for me right now. Yeah, thanks for watching and bye.